But I've only got 50,000 words to go before the end of NaNoWriMo. I thought that it'd be easy, but it's not. Yeah, I've only got 50,000 words to go before the end. Hello, NaNoWriMoers. This is Evil Murr, and I'm here for the day four podcast to keep you going or and convince you to stop NaNoWriMo. Really, I just want you to be happy. But my name is Evil Murr, and you can take everything you need from that. So it's day four. Clearly, if you're still listening, you didn't quit like I suggested you do yesterday. Personally, I am already behind. I had, um, oh, no one cares about Evil Murr's life. But there was some family stuff happening. A little bit of a personal emergency. A little bit of stuff had to be juggled around. A little bit of stress. And so I'm already behind. I'm considering quitting. You should too. But I have really good tea, so I might write some today. So, if you're still here. And if you have fallen behind for reasons such as family emergencies, your spouse or best friend wanted to watch something on Netflix last night. You can't even say a good TV show was on. Oh, World Series. The World Series was on and you wanted to watch the uh, Diamondbacks just get their butts kicked. That was really sad. But I'm not even a Diamondbacks fan. It was just sad to watch. Diamondbacks or Razorbacks? No, Razorbacks or Pigs. Where was I? Right. So, for whatever reason you're behind, how do you catch up? You can do it in one day. One weird trick. And I'm going to talk for 30 minutes without ever telling you what it is, because what really makes me money is the ad money on this video. Except I'm not recording video, because I'm still in my pajamas. And no one needs to see that. And I'm not going to talk for 30 minutes, because I've got a couple more of these to do, because I'm trying to get ahead. Which you could also do when you're writing, but why would you? Because there's something always on in a streaming service. You want to see Across the Spider-Verse? That's on Netflix now, I think. It's on some streaming platform. We have a couple. But anyway, good movie. So I was saying how you catch back up. Plagiarism. That is the rude word for it. You know, like buying the cow is the rude word for wedding. We like to say homage. We'd like to say parody. And really, what you want to do is go copy and paste. You want to copy work somebody else already did the work on and paste it into your own. We say over and over again that the only thing that matters is word count. It doesn't even matter how good they are. Why don't we stretch that a little bit further and say it doesn't even matter if they're yours? You know, a lot of people have asked me, you know, is it okay to copy and paste from something else? Okay is such a wiggle room word. Is it okay according to what? Is it okay according to the rules of NaNoWriMo? Sure. The only goal is word count. Is it okay in the eyes of the U.S. Copyright Office? Do we have a copyright office? No, we have a library of Congress. The copyright people, you know, those shady people with the shades and the black suits and they hunt aliens and look up people who violate copyright. Those people you might need to be afraid of. If you sell it, and your editor doesn't realize it, and your publisher gets sued, that might not be okay. But for word count, who cares? So it's day four. At the end of the day, you should have 6,666 words, or 6,670 if you're really afraid of the number of the beast, which is three sixes, not four, but some people get kind of itchy about that kind of thing. My word count, I haven't even checked. I've been writing in For the Words, which helps me a lot. But getting it from For the Words to Scrivener and updating on the NaNoWriMo website is seemingly beyond my capabilities. It's already been a full month for me, and it's November 4th. So we'll see how the rest of this goes. Remember, my name is Evil Murr. Don't follow any of my advice. If you want to follow advice, check out the I Should Be Writing podcast where podcasts are found. 
If the word evil is not in front of my name, then people say I give pretty good writing advice. Just not this month. I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for listening to our daily NaNoWriMo Patreon-only podcast. I'm Mer Lafferty, Merverse.com, and this music is by permission of John Anilio. You can find out more about him about at johnanilio.com, A-N-E-A-L-I-O. Thanks for your support. <laughs>